behind John McLaughlin in the mall. Don't mind him. He found at my mother yesterday and says he needed to die. Anyway, I'm on the hunt for happy music because although we have a very happy playlist already, some of the songs are getting a bit old, even by my standards. And so, I arranged a meeting with Blue Horizons' Martin Clayton. So, it's, it's nice to meet you, Hi, Mr. And, uh, Martin. Martin, the yes. Blue Horizon. The Blue Horizon, yes. Very nice, happy blue. Right, then what's your role in the band? I, I sing I sing in the band and I, I do the, the rhythm, the background guitar. Oh, so, so you're like the main, the main bit. I, I stand at the front and sing, yeah. Yes, so without you, the band would do... It would just be music. Brilliant, so I've the main man here. The main man. Oh, it's great. Well, I'm, I'm very interested in your music. How's it going? It's all going really well. We've got loads of stuff planned over the summer. We've got, uh, we're going to start filming a music video, get some stuff. Uh, properly recorded, so pe more people can just listen to us and hope get our name out there a bit. Sounds brilliant, yes. Well, I'm interested in having some Blue Horizon music here in Happy Stanley. Yes. yes. So I, I'd rather like that. Well, we've got hits like uh, Marie, Why Did You Have To Go, Heroin, uh, things like that. They're good, good songs, good hearty songs. Marie. Marie, yeah. That's the one about the woman. Yeah, it's, it's about a, a guy that's um, lost a woman, but lo really longing to get her back, but knows that it's probably never going to happen. Right. Well, you see, in Happy Stem, we try to keep things upbeat, you know. I mean, it's got a good beat to it. It's well, yes, but it's, it's, it's quite depressing, really, isn't it? I mean, what's it? It's quite sad. I suppose if you if you listen to the words, yes, it is it is a guy that is heartbroken. Yeah. So it's basically every emotion apart from happy. Yeah, yeah, I'm afraid it is. Well, this is exactly why I've written some of my own lyrics. Okay. Right. All right. We've got to listen to this. I'm this listening. Is quite cool. It goes, Marie, Marie, I love you, dearie. Okay, um, I suppose it rhymes, but what, what about, like, um, there's a line where um, I, I know you'll, you'll never ever be mine. I know you will always, always be mine, and everyone else's, because they might want you as well, and that makes you happy, so you can have her as well. Yes. <sighs> it's not, I, I appreciate it, but there's just too many syllables. No. 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 It's, it's happy, you see, so it works. Right, okay. Don't uh, you know how music works? Yes, I, I, I get how music works by really thinking music's a brilliant way to get over your, your emotions across to everybody. Music can't always be happy, I'm afraid. I think it can be. You know, if, if you can get across happiness to, to everyone, then the world would be a better place, wouldn't it? It would be, it would be a misconceived place. It would definitely be misconceived. There is not a single world where everyone is happy. Misconceived. Misconceived. No. No, 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 no. Is it Happy Stan? Happy Stan is a place where everyone's here. Everyone. Yes. So, showing a song where you've got, you know, people rapping about everyone not getting their Marie, it's not going to work, is it? <sighs> I suppose not. Right. So, yes. Okay, um, what about like the, tr the tractor song? A, a nice upbeat jingle about a tractor. I do like the tractor song, yes. It never crashes, does it? No, it breaks down and the farmer dies, actually. The farmer dies? Yes, because the tractor breaks down. I should have listened to it a bit longer, I think. Yeah. Yes, the last, the last verse. Okay, maybe not the tractor song then. Well, why can't you change it? So the farmer gets dead, but... He was actually really evil. And it's a good thing he's gone. Yes. And the tractor's the hero. Yes. 
I can I can look into it. I can look yes, into it. Look into great. It. So yeah, so this, this deal, I think it's going really well. So how much? What do you mean, how much? How much for the bend? No, wait. So we're not for sale. Blue her eyes. Yes. Isn't for sale. No. Well, you're saying basically that in order for me to show your songs, you have to we would have to purchase the rights. It, the, the, you can buy the CDs? We would have to buy every CD. And ha how much do these CDs cost? It's the same as a normal CD. I mean, what, you're looking at £8 at a supermarket, or...? Well, I'm willing to pay you 17 million haponians. 17 million haponians? Yes. And how much is that in sterling? Oh, oh, yes. £7.62. £7.62. Yes. You want to buy four people? Yes. For seven quid? £62. I mean, the album's only, what, 30, 38p more? Yes, but that's one album. You see, if I can buy you for £7.62, pets, I can have any song I want live from Blue Horizon. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I totally, I'm, I don't understand where, what, what, what are you going to do with us well, after you bought us? I got it all sorted already. I bought it this morning. It cost more than £7.62, I can tell you that, yes. Well, you would be living in a deluxe. This. We're not living in a hamster cage. Uh, it's not a hamster cage, Martin. It's a person cage. Once again, we are not living in what is essentially a big hamster cage. I water you every day. I don't care. You have fresh food. We have that here. No, I'm, we're not. We're not for sale. N no, I don't. I don't think you're getting this. You, you see, you you, you can't. No, you you can't say no. Um, I'm I'm sorry, but I am about to say no, and I'm just I'm a bit confused about everything that's going on here. So I'm just going to leave. Okay, sorry, but no. John, my boy, my boy, can't let you leave. Martin, wait. You can't go. You can't leave my blum in my bob! <laughs> what an absolute psycho. I, why would I work with him? You're fine. You'll have one of those toilets. Fine. You have forced me to do this. What? Uh. Holy shit! go very well. But I did get the CD. Next time, we go after both Hannah Montana and Miley Cyrus. I'm going to put them in together. Make a duet. I will never have seen it before. Yes? I'm sir, they're the same person. You know what to do.